we have some breaking news out of Fresno State tonight. We have learned that two of the university's basketball players were injured in a fatal accident near Table Mountain Casino earlier this week. Action News Sports Director Tommy Tran has been making calls all night on the story. He joins us from the newsroom with what he's learned. Tommy? Yeah, Liz, real quickly, I want to uh, clarify one of the players is, is seriously hurt. The other one actually walked away from that incident. Now, I have been able to confirm with Fresno State that sophomore forward Braden Anderson suffered what's being called a serious neck injury from Tuesday night's deadly crash on Fryant and Millerton Roads in Fresno County. Now, Community Regional Medical Center is telling us that Braden is in critical condition tonight. A Highway Patrol report shows Anderson was a passenger along with fellow teammate and walk on Kyle Jackson in this 2011 Dodge truck when that crash occurred. Now, four vehicles total were involved. 26-year-old Norman Jones Tess lost his life that night. The CHP is still investigating but has already told Action News drugs and alcohol are not factors in that deadly crash. Anderson transferred to Fresno State and missed most of last season, only playing 10 games at the end of 2012 2013. He was expected to take on a bigger role with the dogs, especially with the departure of seven foot center Robert Upshaw out of San Joaquin Memorial. Of course, his health at this point is the family's and the university's number one priority, and we will keep you updated as more information comes along online and on air. That's the latest in the newsroom. Tommy Tran, ABC 30 Action News.